All right, good morning, guys. So we just woke up and I just got out of the shower. Um, it's what, 4.46 right now here in Toronto. We're about to head to sets. I just gotta pack up and get ready. We got our call time for 5.45 in the morning. Um, and yeah, we got, I'm not too sure we got today, but it's nothing too crazy, but I'm excited. My first day on set today. We've been doing rehearsals basically all week. So today's just gonna be a quick vlog for you guys. Um, I obviously can't film while I'm at work, but I'll update you guys as I go throughout my day. So, let's get it. All right, we're all set up, rocking the OG routine merch and the routine joggers with some Balenciaga speed sacks. And yeah, we're just gonna head into a quick meditation uh, for 10 minutes, and then uh, we're gonna bounce to set. Let's go. One eternity later. All right, so it's now 6.46. We just finished wrapping out. We had about like a 13 hour day, which is awesome. Had a lot of experience today. The stunt was pretty funky. I can't talk about it too much, but I did get an adjustment. Um, it was a little more dangerous. But uh, yeah, that's all I can say. Um, it was an awesome day. Met a lot of new people. And now I'm just heading back to the hotel. So let's go drive back to the hotel. Totally forgot to turn all my lights off before I left. Oh, but we made it. We're back home. Feeling kind of sore. My eyebrows are on fleek. They definitely colored those in. Yeah, I feel good. Um, not really sure what we're gonna do for the rest of the day. I'm thinking maybe grab some groceries. I'm all out. Um, yeah, I don't know, maybe do a little bit of shopping, find something for my baby girl. Um, yeah, so let's get changed up and head out. All right, this is the fit we got going. We got the Rain and Champs hoodie. We got some Playboy, and then we're rocking the routine joggers, as usual. Uh, first stop, we're gonna go to Livestock. Um, it's a streetwear brand. We also have one in Vancouver. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna go check it out and see if they have anything for women. Let's go. All right, so it turns out that Livestock and Raining Champs both close at 8 p.m. And right now it's 7.23, so we got like 40 minutes to finish up this shopping haul. Um, and yeah, let's try and get it. All right, so we ended up picking up two pieces of clothing from a thrift store uh, for my girlfriend and myself. Um, there was nothing at Livestock that I really wanted. And now we're just gonna go to this random vegan place to pick up some dinner. We got our food, we got our shopping done. So we just got back to the hotel room. I'm just gonna show you guys quickly what I picked up um, at the thrift store. We got this nice, goofy pullover. It's an extra large, so it's gonna be a nice, big, fit, comfy. Love it. And then for Emma, we got her this old vintage New York Mets bomber jacket. It's a starter jacket. Very clean, very vintage, very old school look. She's gonna love it. Uh, she actually already messaged me. She said she likes it. That's why I picked it up. But uh, yeah, and let's check out the beautiful vegan food that we picked up at the store. Here we go. We got some delicious. Yams with garlic aioli. And then we also picked up some quinoa bowl, uh, which is gonna be very, very tasty. It's like a salad. It's got like quinoa at the bottom. But yeah, I'm switching more to like a vegan diet recently and I feel a lot 
healthier uh, since switching over. Uh, but I did have a long chat with uh, one of my friends that I met um, on set. His name is Eli. He actually has a YouTube channel of his own. Welcome back, aspiring free melons to the Free Melon Society. I'm Eli. Thank you so much for joining me again today. It's called the Free Melon Society. I'm going to link it below as well as put a little thing right here showing uh, his channel. But yeah, me and him talked for like a good hour and a half. He talked to me a lot about nutrition and health and life in general. He's basically extremely educated in like old hermetic principles and laws of the world, specifically in the health area. And he's a fruitician, which is basically he only eats fruits. And this guy looks so freaking healthy. It's amazing how like healthy this guy looked just from eating fruits. Um, and he was talking about this mono fruit cleanse where you only eat grapes or you only eat apples or you only eat uh, oranges for 14 days, 30 days or three days. And it basically fasts the body and it cleanses the body. Um, and yeah, he talked to me about it. He, has a, actually, he actually has a video about it on his YouTube channel. I'll link that below as well. Um, and I'm thinking of doing it and maybe switching over to a fruit-based diet if it actually um, cleanses and fasts all of the toxic stuff inside my body. Cause I am kind of noticing small things here and there. I feel like I have a lot of mucus in my throat and like nasal area. I don't know if that's from like having milk in the past or cheese or whatnot or even like meat just kind of building up all that like gross stuff um so yeah we're gonna see we're gonna test out um like a 14 day grape cleanse sometime in the near future kind of motivated by my friend eli from the free melon society so yeah just wanted to give a shout out to him is an awesome channel lots of knowledge on his channel this guy is so educated like i said once again but uh yeah let's just jump straight into this meal and then we're going to be doing some editing on my laptop over here in the corner so that basically wraps up today thank you guys for watching if you guys like this little vlog video leave a comment below let me know hit that like button if you guys liked it and subscribe if you want to see more videos from me but yeah it wraps things up I love you guys. Peace out.